Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to another video. We have a jam-packed day today. There's a lot going on right now. We're just about to get into it now. So Josh's car is, <laughs> is looking wild right now. Basically, he stripped everything down. The bottom of the car is about to go get blasted, I think on Monday. So he basically threw on stock suspension, some steelies, you can see how high this thing is sitting. The rear matches the front. That's how you can tell this thing is crazy light right now. Super light. But he's blasting the bottom to get it cleaned up. And then we'll start throwing stuff back in. But this is just very temporary stage for the car. <laughs> he threw the lip on. Yeah. Basically with Strat's EG, as you can see, he already got the motor and transmission in today that he had set aside for it. He's actually got a lot more hooked up than I thought he would, but he's been on it today. So gonna do a little bit more touching up on this, but he went and got his EL out of storage because this thing blew up a couple months ago. He decided to turn up the boost in it and she went pop. So we got this girl here, gonna be stripping it right now. These wheels are gonna be going onto the EG. So right now he's in the process of getting these guys off and knocking these guys off, we're gonna see how it looks. I think it's gonna be crazy. I'm just trying to see it in my head. It's gonna look so good. All right, y'all, car's on the ground. Car's on the ground and it's looking crazy. Guys, we gotta drop it a little bit lower, but it's gonna be sick. Money? Just like that. Yeah. You gotta bring it back to the days, bro. Yeah. Be fucking, be Josh and Danny just scraping, boy. <laughs> Big wheels. Just... Dang. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm starting to love this thing more and more. Mike just got done detailing this clean F80. I like this one a lot. It has the carbon roof on it. Such a cool look. So he just got done touching this one up. And so he's about to get ready to start coating it here soon. This thing's gonna be glossy when it gets coated. Guys are getting ready to pull this motor out. This car will be going to a new home soon, so. Gotta grab a couple things, this motor's blown. And Josh about to get busy. Joshin. Thank you guys, dude. <laughs> I'll give you guys a... Me and Joshua just got the suspension almost all wrapped up. We just got to take out this big guy in here. And then loosen it up from the top hat. She should be ready to drop out. We're getting closer. This Honda's all over this place, man. Just had a little S2K pickup. This thing is just looking too good, dude. Got the Type R valve cover on there. So I guess I didn't tell you guys, this is a built GSR. It's a B18C1. So yeah, built, built GSR, um, built transmission. Strat also polished this transmission. This is one that you guys saw in Josh's car. It was Strat, so just swapped it into this car. Josh is gonna pick him up another transmission. Yeah. Strat's ripping up the wiring in here. Josh is just about ready to get the odor pulled. All the oil and coolant is drained on there. So final steps, get these mounts out. Just like that. Whew. 
It's been a crazy morning. We're trying to get over to Pueblo for this PFI fest. And I freaking forgot my, or I locked my keys in my truck last night. So that just took away a bunch of time. So just got the cars loaded up. We're about to head up there now, running a little bit behind schedule. All right, guys, we made it to the track. We got uh, Travis, Kendall, Mike, and Connor back there. Whole gang made it. Got Kondusky, Trav, my boy Mike, Kendall, Josh, Strap. Tish is in there too. Oh. What? All right, so we're pulling the car off the trailer and it wasn't moving, so. Uh, gave it a little bit more gas fast. and she pulled off too, a little bit too fast so bumper got plucked off right there and basically this bracket that holds my radiator like it got the bottom tabs got pulled down so my boy josh is down here about to bend it back for me shout out to my boy josh he's a freaking lifesaver he just got my bumper all fixed back up and my radiator support we had to bend it back so, we back in action, eh? <laughs> She's looking good. She's sounding good. All this damn soot all over my hood. I gotta walk, clean the car again. We're here, though. The vent is starting to come out. Got the boys out. Honestly, I was like, like I, I had heard things about the track, but they redid it recently, right? Yeah, because I was worried it was gonna be like all like dirt at the end or like dirty, not like a dirt road. But yeah, no, nah, it doesn't look too bad. Should be a good day. Susie just got here. Rico just pulled up. They're gonna also be boofing with us. Shane in the all-wheel drive CRX. Here's Brent's S2K right here. Here's Mario's Prelude right here. It's the 
fastest prelude in the States. Might be the world. Forgot it did like an eight second pass. Jamie and them are going in on his car right now. So much. They'll, they'll probably save the car. Thank you. Next, I've got a black TL yeah, 1015. All right, man. Woo! I got a TL too. I love them. They're the funnest, man. Thank you for coming out and being part of all this. I appreciate it so much. Oh, it's uh, super rad you came out and represented. 1000 Subi Wagon. Subi Wagon. Woo! Hey! Look at you. Crushing it. That is fun. It's so great. All right. Best engine bay. 1007 Black Integra. Woo! Is that true? Hey, Spencer. <laughs> Coming out here. Street style. He is always styling. Always. Dude. You're going to shake my hand or what? <laughs> nice job. Thank you. Thanks for coming out and Good shit, on your squad. Buddy. You guys are always the raddest. All right. Yeah, no, I called that shit, boy. I told you. you this is, this is nice where we started off, so yeah, I can't thank you enough for coming out. And uh, I think we got the two step competition oh, yeah, coming up at 5 30. So stick around and join us and have a good time and let's get loud and let's have some fun. Woo! Let's watch some race until then. Yes, sir. Right, this thing is crazy. I'm pretty sure it's a Dodge Magnum with a Charger rear end, front end, and wheels, I think. It's different. I saw it this morning. I was like, what the heck is that? It's crazy looking. My boy Mike's car wasn't running for a second. Boys just got her back started up. What was it? There's a kill switch in here. Oh, it got kicked. There's a kill switch in here? Did you even know about it, Mike? No? <laughs> All right, guys. We just made it back to the shop. It was a wild day. It was a fun one. Um, we ended up leaving a little bit early because the weather started coming in and we just didn't want to risk anything. So we made it back safely. Thank God, I'm very happy. And uh, the cars are ruined. They look disgusting right now. Literally, yeah, we drove through a bunch of rain patches and stuff, so they're all dirtied up, but we had a good time and we made it back. So <sighs> definitely can't wait to start hitting the track up some more. Eventually, I'll take this thing down there. But yeah, man, it was fun. I've never really entered like a car show like that. Like, I don't know, I just never really entered my car to do anything, so that was kind of cool. Type R was getting all types of love today. Strat 1, best engine bay, as you guys saw. But yeah, we're gonna run. Oh, it was smooth. I think, uh, I think Brandon threw a great event. I think that. Pueblo, great people, but uh, should have prepared a little bit better for things that can happen. I think the track cleanup when cars would break just took a little too long. But, yeah. you know, we're so used to Van Amer, which is a very well thought out track. It's been around for years. Pueblo's been around for a long time too, but like Van Amer, you know, it's another level. They really, you know, excelled and exceeded their expectations with, with how they prep, how they clean up. Uh, their safety everything is just so advanced so it was cool to, to be at another track in colorado but uh man i miss bandit <laughs> yeah, me too honestly I miss and, uh, yeah it's been and it's two hours away the drive wasn't too bad uh but overall it was it was, it was a good day it yeah. was a good day uh all the you know all of the cars that we brought was me emery rico was there uh the whole team was there yeah uh, we had uh, one of our clients, good friends too, Tiffany and Mike, they were racing a little single cam that we built for them. So it was, it was a good day. Um, everyone had fun, took home some awards, and uh, all the cars got love. So yep. it was cool. It was Huge shout out to PFI and their whole team, uh, Goo Lagoon, all those guys for putting on the event and inviting us and everything. Awesome trophies, by the way. Yeah, the trophies look sick. Now, like, all the car shows that we do, I would have to say, you guys killed it with the trophies they were they're <laughs> awesome they, yeah you know, they're, they're very thought out and and, and, and you know, we're really stoked to have them. they look so, sick yeah uh looking forward to next year hopefully 
next year it's uh, at the new Bandamere. Yeah, Bandamere Band Band Part 2. <laughs> uh, other than that, I mean, I think it was a freaking awesome event. We had a, had a good time. So. Yeah. yeah, we made it back, so we got to get these cars unloaded, rinse them off real quick, and then drop the trailers off, and we're going to call it a day. So. Enjoy the rest of the weekend. Yeah, appreciate you guys for watching, man, and we'll see you later. Peace. Hey.